Nottingham is a beautiful place to live, it's a city, it's a people. Nottingham has a real sense of pride around their community and optimism around the future. Got a thriving economy, big student population, leading edge biotechnology industry, so there's a real sense that the city's pushing forward and it's moving, but also some realism that everything's not perfect. This place was really rough. Before, you could have come round here. It was proper drug dealers, a lot of crime. I think without a stable home, without a decent home, your life opportunities are limited. Do you have a room where you can go and do your homework? Or are you living in somewhere that's so unsuitable that the only warm room is the kitchen? The key challenges were, to a certain extent, addressed through the, the process, which was involving people, involving residents. Every month I think there was meetings. This is a different way of living now. When people see this place, they can't believe it. We've deliberately built a number of family homes. You know, it's really good to have that mix of people. While having universities and further education is very, very important to the local economy, it also has its impact in traditional communities pushed out and feel a sense of loss. We have been established as the university think tank. Our focus is around research that can have impact for the benefit of local communities. Residents, but also other stakeholders in a place, are looking increasingly to universities, to health services, to maybe housing associations to say, well, what are you going to do with your money? I believe this concept of anchor institution is becoming more important and more impactful because there is less money in the public sector. We've heard examples today where the university, the, the city council, um, housing associations, the police, have all articulated what their needs are, but have all also pulled together. And sometimes it's one of those anchor organisations that takes the lead. Mm -hmm.